Hi guys, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw a unicorn ice cream. So let's get started. To draw this unicorn ice cream, we're going to first start by drawing the horn. So I'm just going to go ahead and go up for the angle, round it off towards the top, and bring it right back down. And I'm not going to stop at the same level. I'm going to come uh, stop a little bit short, but right there. And then I'm just going to connect it, round it off right there, and connect it with a curve. So then from there, we're going to come up right here, a little bit above the, um, where we ended, and we're just going to draw a curve down. So about right there, just draw a curve. And then we're coming down to the other side, and we're going to come lower. So this is a little bit higher. We're going to come down about right here, and we're going to draw another curve that comes out. So just kind of tuck it in. And so it's just a little mound of ice cream at the top where the horn sticks in. So before we um, get further down, let's just come back in here and give our horn some details. So we're just going to add some curves, so we'll give it some dimension. So then now we're going to start to build our mound of ice cream. So just remember this is our center. Everything is just going to be built around it. So from there, let's come to this side and I'm just going to go ahead and draw another curve. And then let's go on this side, about right here. And every time I draw this side, it's going to be lower than this side. So about right here, I'm just going to come down. And then let's come over here again. And let's see here, about right here. So notice everything, this is still the center of everything. And then let's go down one more over this side. And then again. So let's go one more, last one. So this is going to be a little bit shorter, but we're still angling out. So right there. And then um, on this side, I'm just going to make sure I end up at the same level right there. So there, I got my mound of <laughs> ice cream in. So you can come in here. Just give us some details. Just bring out the line a little bit for the crease in the ice cream. So this side will go up, and this side comes down. Okay, so then from there, let's come right here and connect it with a curve. So this is going to be the beginning of our cone. And connect it. That's why we want it to be at the same level so that we can go ahead and connect it for our cone. Okay, so then from there, let's come in here and I'm just going to give it a tiny little curve right here for where the cone is, just a little bit. And it's going to start to draw my cone. So what I need to do is come up right here where my center is and go straight down best I can. So say about right here. I'm going to stop. So that's about how long I want my cone to be. And from there, I'm going to drag a line all the way down here. So that's my center. I'm just going to try my best to go all the way. And as I get here, I'm just going to round it off. And then the same thing on this side. So I'm going to drag. You know what? I'm going to go up this way. It's a little bit easier for my hand. So turn the paper if you need to. Whichever way is more comfortable for you. Since this, this is a pretty long line. Okay, there. Got my cone in. So now for some details, I'm going to come right here and just draw a curve right across. And just give myself a point so I know where to go on the other side. Just to give my cone some detail. And then uh, from there, let's give this uh, unicorn uh, ice cream some ears. So about right here, I'm going to draw some ears. I'm going to come out, round it off, and come right back in. And let's come in here for some details the inside of the ear and so it's the same thing on the other side so I'm just going to drag some points across 
so that I'm not too far off. And right there, come bring it back in. And the inside. Okay, so I have the two ears in now. Now let's bring it to life. So um, I'm going to come over here towards the bottom and I'm going to draw some happy, happy eyes. So right here, I'm just going to draw a curve down. So I'm going to come right across about right here and draw the other eye. And let's give it some lashes. I'm just going to go in here and thicken it up a little bit more. And then right in between, let's give a sweet, happy smile and cap it off. Okay, so then now I'm going to go in here and draw all the um, sprinkles. So I'm going to switch to a thinner Sharpie because I don't want it to be too thick because it is the um, sprinkles. So I'm going to come back in here and just decorate it. So do it however you like. So I'm just going to add some of these. Oh, if my sh Sharpie would work. <laughs> So this is just the ultra fine point sharpie, just a little bit thinner. So I'm going to come in here at different angles. I'm just going to add some sprinkles here and there. So maybe one here. And let's see here, another one over here. And I'm going to go in there and add some stars. So, but right here, I'm just going to add small little star sprinkle another one over here and let's see here we have one over here and then i'm going to come in here and just add some circles here and there So I hope this drawing really inspires you and you have fun drawing it. Decorate your um, unicorn ice cream however you like. And then you can draw some, um, color some cheeks in when you're um, coloring it. And then from there, let's see here. I'm gonna come in here and give my cone some details. So I'm basically going to follow the outside line just kind of thinly draw these angle lines and then I'm going to follow this side so about right here oops that one got away from me <laughs> okay well I'll fix that later in the computer. <laughs> Not a big deal. Okay, so then from there, let's add some sparkle for the shiny horn if you want it. Come up here and we're just going to draw some sparkle. And maybe one more here just to add some bling to it. So that's pretty much it for this Trust So Cute Unicorn Ice Cream. Hope you guys love how it turned out. And if you do, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Trust So Cute videos. See you later.